Hi there, I hope you're doing well. This is Victoria from CrushCrypto.com. In this video, I will be talking about Chainlink, which is a decentralized oracle that connects blockchain with outside data. I'll explain in a bit what that means. I am personally very excited about what Chainlink is doing because they could be a critical game changer in the crypto space that will drive blockchain and smart contract technology forward. Chainlink hasn't released their white paper yet, so our research and analysis is only based on the info we currently have on hand. We will update our report as soon as the white paper is released, so please subscribe to our email newsletter if you haven't already. And a quick disclaimer before I start, we aren't paid to do this or any of our reviews. This is just our personal opinion and analysis and not investment advice. To start off, let me give you a quick refresher on what a smart contract is, as this is critical to what Chainlink is trying to do. Smart contracts are essentially computer protocols or lines of code that facilitate, verify, or enforce a contract. Let me illustrate this with an example. Let's suppose you have a contract with a travel insurance company. You pay them annual premiums for insurance coverage, and in return, they will compensate you if you miss a flight when the plane does not arrive on time. Now let's say you did miss a flight, and now you're trying to make a claim. If this was a traditional contract, this process could take a painfully long time with a lot of back and forth. The idea of a smart contract is that the code is all set up already so that if you did miss a flight because the plane didn't arrive on time, it automatically enforces the contract. You don't need to do anything and you would be paid out in just minutes. Not only is this extremely efficient, it also takes away the uncertainty of enforcing a contract. This table summarizes some of the other benefits of using smart contracts. So where does Chainlink fit into all of this? Chainlink is a middleware that connects smart contracts with off-chain resources like data feeds, APIs, and any other sort of resource that exists outside of the blockchain. The technical term of this middleware is Oracle. With Oracles, it's possible to create smart contracts that do payouts between two parties once certain criteria are met, and there is no need for a middleman. So back to my travel insurance example. In order for that smart contract to work smoothly, it needs to be connected with your bank account and with a travel insurance company's bank account so that the payment can occur automatically. An Oracle would be able to do that. Right now, smart contracts haven't been able to do this, and that's a big piece of the puzzle missing. We think Chainlink is a critical game changer that will drive smart contract technology forward. Here's an example of what a Chainlink Oracle might look like. Basically, this oracle obtains an authenticated data feed of the Ether price and feeds it into an Ethereum smart contract. Chainlink has developed oracles that can allow smart contract creators a way to interact with different data providers, payment solutions, and banks. This chart shows the extensive reach that their decentralized oracle network could have, and they are the first to be doing this. Through Chainlink, every data provider, bank, and API can sell their core services to a smart contract. Chainlink will be issuing their Link tokens starting on September 7th in a public crowd sale. The hard cap is $32 million, and the total supply will be fixed at 1 billion tokens. 35% of the tokens are going to the public sale, which implies a maximum market cap of $91 million. Please check Chainlink's website for the most up-to-date information on their ICO. So why does Chainlink need a token system? The vast majority of smart contracts need external data to execute properly. Right now, it is very challenging to get this data, and that is why Chainlink exists. Their token compensation system helps ensure accurate data and increase decentralization across the network. Smart contract users will use Link tokens to pay data, payments, and other service providers for their services. The more Chainlink platform is used, the more valuable Link tokens will become as the supply is fixed. Chainlink currently has a team of two people, both serial entrepreneurs with relevant experience. The founder and CEO is a veteran in the blockchain space. Chainlink has a strong team of advisors, including the Professor of Computer Science at Cornell Tech and the Associate Professor of Computer Science at the University of Illinois. They have also been recognized by credible organizations, and they are currently working with Swift and Cornell. So on to the opportunities. With the development of oracles, blockchain technology, and smart contracts will become more useful with a lot more applications. Different kinds of contracts can be enforced and executed in a trustless manner. We believe Chainlink's Oracle network could help blockchain technology reach mass adoption, and this is a very significant opportunity.
Chainlink is also partnered up with Swift, which is currently used by more than 11,000 banks worldwide. They already completed a Phase 1 proof of concept back in June 2017, with Swift being a paying customer of Chainlink. This valuable partnership would allow Chainlink to easily partner up with other financial institutions going forward. The team has been working together in the blockchain space for several years already. The parent company, Smart Contract, was founded in 2014, and they came up with functioning products in their previous venture. The network effect is present for this project because their platform will become increasingly more useful as they gradually become the go-to source for blockchain data feeds. Our main concern is that the white paper has not been released yet as of September 1st, and we are less than a week away from the ICO launch date. This may deter some investors or hamper demand as they may feel the ICO could potentially be a scam. However, our view is that this risk is low because of a few reasons. First of all, if the project was a fraud, they would have released a white paper to make it less suspicious. Second, Smart Contract has been around for three years already, and the team has a solid reputation in the blockchain space. And third, they've closed their pre-sale already and they are not accepting any more contributions until the public crowd sale. Overall, we at Crush Crypto think this ICO has good investment potential, both for flipping and for long-term holding. Personally, I hope this project works out as it could make a huge difference in pushing blockchain technology forward and allow smart contracts to actually be smart. The ICO could be good as a short-term investment. There's a lot of interest and hype for this project in the crypto market already, partly driven by a strong team and advisors. A portion of the hard cap has already been sold in the pre-sale, so it shouldn't be too difficult for them to hit their hard cap. The tokens will be distributed immediately after the end of the crowd sale, so you'll be able to sell them right away. We think Chainlink could be a good long-term investment too, as it is solving a genuine and highly lucrative problem with a lot of good use cases. The project has already built traction with Swift being a paying customer, which could potentially give them access to more than 11,000 banks worldwide. Thank you very much for watching this video. Please check out our website for a full report on Chainlink. We will be updating our report once the white paper is released, so please subscribe to our email newsletter and our YouTube channel to get our latest updates. See you next time, and I hope you'll keep on crushing it!